sometimes in a hobby, you need to follow up a slot, slot, a mushroom. Suddenly you find that you can't do safe for tasks. You cannot hire people, you know what? You cannot hire foreigners, but Singapore to force, to force them to do one, so it's a big problem, right? So that's why a lot of food chain goes down, you know? Um, I was just thinking that day, you know, um, a lot of manpower agencies start to do that, but it's not very strong. I'm not too sure whether they have tapped into it. Whereby, a lot of restaurants actually, uh, they use the same way that fashion skills are all the same if you look at it. If you start a manpower agency catering for all these sort of people, some people will need some. So you can see, sometimes some businesses, we have no business. And so therefore, they need less. The other guy is so busy but don't have, but they don't share. So you don't have contract to move around. If you can think of a business, they allow the mobility of individuals who move from Kentucky Fried Chicken to McDonald's and things like that. You can just supply them just in time with the workers. Imagine, you have a pool of workers that you can move around. <laughs> think of that. That could be your enterprise if you want to. Because today I think a lot of Singapore rates are all very selfish. My restaurant only five, I need five. But I only have use for three. The other guys may need more. I cannot send them to them out there to work because I don't have the license. To, I'm not licensed by the power agency to provide. But if you have an intermediary company who pool all these resources and you supply the needs, they just change uniform, that's all. 